Hello you, welcome to Geekism and welcome back to Two Point Hospital where we're going to carry on here with Meltdowns. If you go on to enjoy this video, please let me know by clicking on the like button. And if you're new here and you'd like to see lots more creative gaming for grown-ups, all you have to do is click subscribe. Look at this poor guy, just got a look at this. This is a shock clinic because he's got you've got the shock issue we need to try and fix you later um but yes yeah, so we've got a few things to address uh, from last episode thank you very much for all your feedback it really does help me out to notice just notice stuff that i miss basically it does happen i'm mean, unfortunately it does happen um a couple of things one uh is we don't have any bins outside i swear if i had a pound for every time i forgot that i would have uh, well, about twelve pounds to be honest. It wouldn't be a massive amount, but still, we want to make sure that we've got some bins in the corridors, especially where people are getting um, uh, food and drink and stuff. So, we'll have a few of those around here. That's good. And uh, uh, not really much need for. Oh, actually, there's two pieces of rubbish there. So actually, yes, there very much is a need for one here. And we'll have one there for now. Although I'll probably get moved once we build some more rooms. And then here, and I wonder maybe this is why there's more sick around because a lot of the time I think they throw up in bins as well. It's pretty gross, but I'd rather than do that than the floor, I suppose. Um, the other thing is that somebody mentioned is if you put the hygiene things inside rooms as well, it can actually really help with uh, with hygiene. So we'll uh, we'll do that. that. Pharmacy wasn't level five, but that pharmacy is level five. So why isn't that pharmacy level five? Huh. Um, all the GPs can have one, I guess. We can squeeze them in. Yeah. Uh, and the other thing that people mentioned as well is having coffee machines and sweet machines. You might level five. How weird. Um, will help as well, but I, I don't honestly don't think we have the room for those, unfortunately. Um, but we may bear that in mind for later uh, later builds. I'm not too sure whether it, it's really needed in the research lab, but we'll put it in. There we go. And um, I guess staff room can have one. There we go. So that's going to help with hygiene a little. Uh, I think that was about it, really. Oh, and we haven't got anyone for the ward, was the other thing that people mentioned. Let's have a look at that. Uh, nurses. Qualifications. Uh, well, no, we do. We have uh, Nigel Rancid, uh, although he's getting trained. So we'll we'll put you in the ward as well for now while Nigel gets trained, which I think he's on the way to do. Yeah, on the way to do. Hospital is massively in debt, but I, I, I hope it won't be for much longer. Uh, there is somebody in here doing fluid analysis. There's a bit of a queue. Uh, here we go. Here's the staff. So you're, Nigel's getting trained. Are you a guest trainer? Yeah, Gordon Nightingale. Nice. Um, send patient home. Sorry. We're just not ready for you. I don't even think we have it uh, researched. Shock therapy. Let's have a look. Uh, no, I think we're going to have to research it. What we can do is start the research here, then jump over somewhere else um, where it's a bit easier to deal with. Why have we got no... We need to hire a new nurse, don't we? We can't hire a new nurse. Warning. Yep. Hire a nurse. Mm, you look good. Diagnostics and ward management. Aaron Mouth. We can't do it because we've got £22. Very slight earthquake there. Didn't really seem to affect anything. That's good. Do we have... Any nurses? Or, oh, they're all in here. Okay, they're coming out of here now, aren't they? Oh no, it says just say that you're on a break still for nine days. Which is pretty weird. You put some rubbish in there, that's good. Ah! You've had to come out to find that bin. Right, so in that case, we need a bin in here to stop that happening, because that seems a little bit useless. There we go. Now they'll stay in the staff room while they throw things away. All right, well, we'll let them have their break, and then we'll see what, see how it's looking then, because that means all nurses are unavailable, but there's not really much we can do at the moment, although we do have the cash to bring in a... No, none of you are very good at pharmacy. That's the problem. I guess Lyd Lydia Goods, at least you're uh, a lump of clay we can mould, you know? Oh, hello. Got you. Monobrow. Killed. Fracture emergency? Nope. Uh, treatment in our wards, nice. We can manage that quite well. Um, yeah, I think a little research department's going to be next, else we're going to have nowhere near uh, the ability to do this. We are just... Get some patient home. Uh, we need this pharmacy. Why is nobody coming into here? Ward management 2 is done. Nice, Nigel. 
Let me look at you. Superb. Get yourself um get yourself picked up. No, can we not? You going for a break first, are you? No, you're looking good. Get here. Why can't I pick you up, Nigel? Hey. Go to work in the ward. Get yourself in the ward. Hello? Right, so there we go. I was gonna say, what is going on here? So now Nigel's back. Are uh, any of our nurses more suitable to work in pharmacy? Didn't we say it was going to be you, didn't we? Yeah. Lucy Bat, where are you? Looking for work. Get yourself in there, Lucy. You can clear off now. Bye. Uh, actually, no. I won't get rid of you. Um, I'll get rid of you. Because I want to... I'm not interested in the, in the teaching thing. Treatment with emotional intelligence. You're pretty good. Ward, you're good at ward. So you're going to stay in the ward. All right, and then you're gonna, and then Lydia, you're gonna be a, a floater, so to speak. Um, looks like our assistant's cleared off. Let's just throw in a new assistant for a minute. Ah, we've just got no money, and I think didn't we have both loans? Oh no, we can still have this loan. Right, let's just do that because otherwise, it's not gonna be a very fun episode. Um, right, promote, yes, promote. Who were you? It's all about managing staff properly in this time around. Here we go. Here we go. You were Re Pat Pumps. Oh, Pat Pumps. You are the legend that is Pat. Um, let's get a course going for you. Course is available. General practice three. E Huggles can come in. Pat Pumps. Start. And in the meantime, we'll hire a pretty good doctor. Oh, God. We've already spent that 20 grand. Uh, Pat, you've got a stash. Yes, Pat's awesome stash. Hold on. Didn't we just take out a loan for 50 grand? On earth did all that money just go on? Like, we built nothing. How did we go from 50 grand to nothing? Is it just because our, our revenue is just that low? Ouch. Okay, well, at least, uh, at least the pharmacy is now recuring people, which is good. It's got a bit of a queue. Let's open this one up. And hire a, um, a crappy nurse to go in there. There we go. And that'll spread the queue out a little. Should do anyway. Yeah, there we go. go get in there and get cured, please, if you're pharmistic, pharmacistic. A lot of people waiting on here. You need a nurse as well for the fluid accelerator. Okay. Um, one queue in there. How, how long is the queue here? Four. Right, in that case, after you, you're going to jump over here onto that one. Uh, send patient home. Okay. Right. Sorry, you're now closed. All right, and you, coming over here. We've now gone to a six queue on the pharmacy, that's fine. You get over there and start working towards getting the fluid treatment done. Uh, so diagnosing, he is going all right, although they're not doing a very good job of it. Who are you, George? Yeah, you're the one. GPGP, GP. you should be pretty good. Is it because your energy's so low? What about you? Uh, again, GPGP, GP, you should be pretty good as well. Boo, boo, boo. Um, there's a queue outside fluid analysis. Worth building another one? No. There's somebody in there now, so that queue will begin to fall down. Let's get you. Sorry, I didn't mean to pick you up. I'm on, I'm on the fast speed, but I can still do it because I'm awesome. Um, we need some benches here. Along here. Some bench. There we go. There's a lot of people standing up. What are you running from? Oh, a ghosty ghosty. We have a staff member that can deal with that, do we not? Um, let us see. Mechanic with ghosty abilities, yes. Come over here, please. Why can't... <coughs> Excuse me, why can't I pick staff up? To combat ghost, please. Yes, please. Okay, what we got here? Staff training required. Which nurse are you? Lydia Goody. You're our basic nurse. Okay, so we're going to make you the pharmacy extraordinaire, all right? Um, pharmacy management. Start training. There we go. So, is, are you done, uh, 
Pat Pumps? Where's Pat Pumps? Were you our guest trainer? Okay. Doctors. Pat Pumps. Oh, Pat Pumps is killing it. And he's already back to work. What an absolute ledge. Um, on a break. So we've got a doctor free. Do we keep him or do we fire him now? It's pretty good diagnosis and psychiatry. Hmm. Are we making money now? We are making money now. Good. Now, now that the uh, this is running and this is running better, it looks like we're making money. Still a bit of a queue on pharmacy. Still a hell of a queue on that. Um, but we're going to start working on a decent nurse. Um, and that will probably help there. Not one of these monobrow things. I'm, I'm all over it. Look, come here. Choo -choo. Right. Um, did we do it? We failed to complete 10 people. God. That's depressing, isn't it? Um, Sophie Serverton is assist. Yeah, assistant, whatever. Go for it. I want to build something here. I think we need a bit of research. I know it's a random spot for it. But we can always move it at a later date and probably increase it even as well. But we need to start researching stuff, else we're going to be just sitting here doing very little. Okay, one desk will do. Don't think it increases. Oh, it does increase research power a little. Okay, well, let's do two then. And we have all the servers and stuff. I don't. I think they. I think they unlock separately. So. We're not worried too much about those. Not really worried about this room being all that, to be honest with you. I just kind of need um, the basics beginning, you know. So let's have a couple of stickers on there to say, look how good we are at research. And I think that will probably do it. Radiator. We can't do it behind that window, but we can do it there and there. And we can have a couple of windows in the building as well. There we go. What can't we do? What have we not got? The money? We don't have the money. 46 grand, jeez. Let's get rid of you. Um, let's play the game and hope this number goes up a bit. <laughs> um, tell you what we'll do, actually. We'll turn you around because I think they go back and forth between the two quite a lot. But as the money comes in, we should be able to press play on that because we, we're still earning. Yeah, we're still massively earning. That's good. Taking a look at our reputation, apparently Blala has a high score of 100% and we're at 72. Well, that's increasing for us at least. It was fine before, now it's good. So that's going to help us out. Staff training required. Do you want to stop editing this room? No. We only need two more grams. Come on. Speed up a little. Somebody get in that pharmacy and get, get fixed. Come on. Yep, yep, yep. Good. Money's getting quite low. I know it is. Staff training. Who are you? Orlando Fingers. Junior. Oh, you're a janitor. No, you're not worried about janitors. Um, no, 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 no. No chance. So, are we back on top of this now? Four queuing? Yeah, I'll take that. Are you a good... So, now you're treatment, but actually, you're going to become... Aren't you? Lydia Good, you're going to be our new pharmacy manager. Oh, what was that noise? Uh, send patient home. Uh, yeah. Lydia, good. Promote. Does that mean you're ready to train? Ready for training, yeah. Oh, we'll stay in there then, love. We'll get you on... Um... So I don't think there's a pharmacy management level 2. So I think we just go regular treatment, don't we? 10% treatment skill. Uh, for uh, Yeah, we'll bring in her. Although we can't afford to. Uh, and when there's nobody to train either, do you have to finish the course? Go on and clear off. Revenue settled down again. This next song is for all the hospital patients okay. shaken up by that earthquake. Can we do it now? While you're in treatment, are still in the Lydia, good. Place. Okay. So as soon as we've got, we are really playing. Oh, we can't play the game while that's happening. Okay. Lydia, good. Um. Current rank. I mean, you might as well get in there and work while we've got you. Let's have a look at our nurses. I can't remember where we're up to with our nurses. We have too many of them, I'm pretty sure. Um, Nigel Rancid is doing a great job working towards being the ultimate ward man. Uh, Gerald Bog. Oh, you're working in there. You actually 
injection skills, treatments in the injection room, so you're kind of useless. Um, treatments as well. Right, okay, I'm gonna get, right, Gerald Bog, you're gone, Gerald, sorry Gerald. Lucy Bap, you come over here and work in here, just because you'll be quicker, because you're higher level, even though you haven't got the skills we want. It's actually a diagnosis room, but um, you're just a, just a level four nurse is going to be quicker, isn't, isn't, isn't she? Or her, he. Uh, how are we doing here? The, Pat Pumps, come on, let's see how well you're getting people diagnosed, Pat. 47%, it's just, it's not that good, is it, Pat? General Pat, GP diagnosis, 15%, 15%, 15%. Really should be awesome. Should be awesome at, at diagnosing, really. Uh, what about you? How well do you do? You've got two and a treatment, so you should be the same, so like 47%, shouldn't you? 90% on you. 16%? Oh, because that was the last one. Okay, that's fine. Send patient home. That was the 16% needed to fill her up, I guess. Okay. And here, uh, 12 people still queuing for this. In you come. What's the weight? There's a lot of litter around. No, there isn't. And I can assume it means this stuff because the place is pretty tidy, actually. Is it not? Is it not? Uh, DNA lab. Ugh. Send patient home. We're just not ready for it. Uh, let's find a doctor. See if there's a cheap doctor with research. Um, yes, you there. How much is your fee? Two grand. Nice. Get in there. Let's get. Click to start a research project. We want. Shock Clinic seems to be the one that's really. Uh, really doing us in. So, what we can do now, you see, is start the Shock Clinic here. Right? And then we'll come to the map. And we'll go over somewhere much better established that has research. So. Did we set up research in Lower Bullocks? Let's have a look. Because if we have, we can now get, we can now continue doing shock treatment uh, in Lower Bullocks. Let's have a look. Did we? Did we set up research here? I don't. Maybe not. Maybe the first one we did. Let's have a look. Um, what's the uh, thingy one? I can't imagine we put research in Hogsport, but we might have done. We may well have done. Um, let's see. We did. Yes, we did. Here we go. We've got two guys researching stuff. So what we can do is they're upgrading pest control. Let's not. Let's instead do shock clinic. Start a project. And then I could, we could pretty much, because this one is so well running, this because it's really simple hospital, we can let them research that here, jump back over, and it'll be done. Okay, we're back, and uh, we have both. Uh, oh, we've got an earthquake coming. Let's hope that isn't too bad. Send patient home. For now, send patient home. Uh, we have both um, DNA and uh, shock unlocked now as well, which is good. So, uh, general research, what does, that, what does that do? That gives us 20 grand. Oh, I think we should, yeah. Go, yeah, do some research. <laughs> we need some money. Hello, Monroe. We meet again. Good. So we've now got DNA and shock uh, un available. I think we're going to start with shock because that one seriously is where most people come from uh, to, to get cured. So we're going to actually get rid of our second pharmacy. We're going to sell it. We're going to take 10 grand for it as well. And we're hopefully going to be able to afford this um, shock therapy room. Where is it? Shock clinic. 30 grand. Wah. Okay. Are we making money? We're making money. So let's just get this sped up a little. Um, that's the ward. Is there a nurse? That's fine, there's somebody in here. Nope, they're just worrying about themselves. But buildings are getting fixed. There we go. Janitor is fixing drug machine number two, which is good. Fracture ward required. Uh, send patient home for those. We're not there yet. And I wonder if any of these things will get fixed on the outside. I bet they won't. See, our revenue's gone down again now. Why is God? I wish I could figure out what the up and downs were on these, man. How are we doing for loans? Are we anywhere close to paying them off? 39 grand left on both. Nine. Uh, what do we need for that? Hospital value of 500,000. Uh, and a reputation of 25 and a hospital level of 2. Well, we've got the hospital level. Reputation is 
it just says good. I don't know what 25 means. Okay. We don't want it anyway. We get too much into death, I think, with that. I definitely think that would be too much of an issue. Okay, money, even though revenue is lower than expenses, it does say revenue is coming in. How much is that room again? Because uh, that is definitely the one that people are coming in for, shock therapy. 30 grand. Cures patients with shock horror. Nice. What have we got here? Shock clinic. Yeah. Uh, Set patient open. No, we're not ready for you. Impress the VIP with a nice hospital. Yeah, sure. Why not? We've got a pretty decent hospital here, I think. What's up with you? Are you just looking ill? Estimated chance of cure. Appointment with the pharmacy. Right, okay, yeah, go on. You get yourself cured. The other thing that people have been doing is coming up to here, patients, and clicking on diagnosis. And if it's close, um, you can click them and, and click uh, uh, send for treatment, I think. Let's have a look. Because their health is lower look. There we go. Diagnosis of certainty. Right, so they're going, rather than going to an appointment now, if, if when they come out of being dressed, hold on, let's have a look. Where are you? Monty Codswallop. Right, I thought there was a way of sending for treatments. Hmm. Guess not. Okay, hopefully you get over there. You're all blue, mate. Oh, you've got you've got the denim thing. Uh, we haven't we can't cure you. Go away. <laughs> That's what the problem is. <laughs> we haven't got the ability to cure him. Um, let's have a look. Anyone else we can send? Monty Codswallop. Get out of the room. Let's have a look. What do we think's up with you? You look treatable. I'm going to click send for treatment. Shot clinic required. Let's go home. <laughs> nice. Uh, Robin Dobson, you're already on the way home. You've got you to go home. You've got the denim thing. Now what's up with your neck? Uh, what about you? Yeah, your denim can't do anything with you. Sorry. Uh, could probably treat you, so we'll, we'll see you again on. Choo, 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 choo. Oh, I'm so bad at FPS. Oh, somebody died, that sounds like. Oh, is that junk chap there getting in? Oh dear, never mind. Uh, DNA emergency, nope. Uh, promote, uh, nope. And. Some vision home, there we go. Good. <laughs> there is a lot of. Uh... Oh, they made a ghost as well. Where's the jam? We have a jam, sir. There is a lot of little micromanagey stuff here. I think in the long run it, uh, it'll work out quite well, but right now it's uh, it's pretty full on intense. I do want to put this new rune down though, I want to put this new shock shock therapy rune down. You can see the ones that have it, they go and like have look like a little bit of electricity, which is pretty cool. Oh, we've got a Dulux clean turned up there, sorry mate, we ain't, we ain't going to be able to deal with you just yet. Research doctor's having a break, that's fine, I suppose. Is it? UG Cucumber. Pat Pumps? Can, um... I can say, you're, you're near enough, like, fully energised. There you go. Let's get you back into here, Pat Pumps, because you're a research lady. We need to be up there. We need to fix that, don't we, to not make that happen again? Let's have a look. Research lady, you only do research. There we go. Uh, Pat pumps and you too. Yeah, good. Where's Pat gone? Get in there, Pat. Pat, what's up with you? Get in there, buddy. There you go. Because you are currently level three GP. As soon as that goes up, you're going to be level four. Uh, let's have the other ones that we were working towards helping out. So, yeah, you're not ready yet. Um, ready for training. Oh, so Nigel Rancid, we can get you ward, next level of ward. All right, let's do that then. Because um, you're doing a great job in the ward, buddy. Course is available. Ward management three. Gordon Nightingale can come in. Nigel Rancid. Uh, no, we can't afford it. Oh, my word. Thing. 
tuition fees. So that's going to cost us, what, 25 grand? Oh, we're not a million miles off it then. Pest control sent patient. Oh, we're not ready for pest control coming in yet. Um, no, we won't train Nigel yet. He's doing a fine job as it is. We will train him up when we can, but I think the shock therapy one is more important. Shock clinic. We need to cure five people to get our one-star hospital. And it, whoa, where's all that money just gone? Oh, God, that was... That was Oh, that's killer. Level 5 staff room. How far are we off a level 5 staff room? I mean, we've already got our sneaky, uh, sneaky pictures in. We could maybe put them behind here as well. Sneaky pictures. Where are you? There we go. The old sneaky pictures there. Lovely. That'll give us a. What does that give us? He's happy. Well, I'm glad you're happy. Leaving the hospital. Bungle Tech is leaving the hospital. Hopefully that went well. Um, Stablada has slightly better morale than us. That's fine. Uh, 250 research points. Good. Did that just go onto there, did it? Oh no, it's gone onto that one. That's nice. Because we could do with that bit of cash. Isn't that ridiculous that we're having to do research just on cash? Bit of a queue on the old GP there. Ah, oh, I missed you. Missed you. Right, come on. Yeah, Dr. Shane Bilge, you're, you're, you're not bad. I mean, it's all about pat pumps. But Shane Bilge isn't too bad. We're not going to afford our bills. I think we need a loan. I'd love a loan, mate. Honestly, alone would. We've got another nine months left on that one, and we've got another sixteen months left on that one. So we ain't getting alone anytime soon, I'm afraid, young man. Oh, look at this poor sod here with electricity. Um, there's a big old queue on that as well. Are you the one who's not great? Your pharmacy management, Lydia. You're not meant to be here. Why have we got mixed up there? Nurses. Your, Lucy Bath is meant to be in there. Even though she's not the right one. Oh no, hold on. No, Lydia, we're making you the pharmacy girl. You're going to be a fluid analysis person. And Nigel's the ward. Yeah, that's right. Is that right? Yeah. You're going to swap over? I'll come and help you out. I can't, I can't pick you up. That seems like a bug. I think that's a bug. Okay. Nearly, oh, come on, we're so close. Revenue's on the up and up. If we can just, I know what's going to happen though. We're going to get to January and that number's going to drop down again. Um, send patient home because I don't know how long it's going to be. Ready for this now? Watch this number go. <laughs> View, come on, let's, if we've got any awards for a bit of cash, please, open all, not bad. Okay, that's given us... Uh, it doesn't tell us. I think each of them are about five grand, though, so that should be 15. There we go. Too many janitors. Well, we can fix that. Um, mechanics, maintenance. Go. We can't fix that, actually, without firing some. Let's have a look who, who we got to employ. Uh, oh, you have all three. And you have all three. I'll tell you what, then. Let's hire you. And you. And then we'll fire, I'm afraid, the other three. Um, all three, all three, yeah. So you've got to go, sorry, yes. You've got to go, yes, yes. And you've got to go, sorry, yes, yes. So now we've got two good janitors who were covering the job of three average janitors before, which is probably worth doing. Other than that, there's not really much we can do. Research, she's gone for a nap again, that's fine. She wants clinic, no, send patient home. We really need to concentrate on getting this shock therapy because that's going to be a big treatment that brings us in cash, I'm sure. Fracture ward, send patient home. Let's have a look at our patients. Is there anyone who's nearly diagnosed? Diagnosis certainty, right. Treatment, go. Shock clinic required, go home then. <laughs> um, you're in the appointment now, so that's fine. 
Uh, shotgun you go. The problem is they start dying. There we go. Ly Lila's just died. Good. Uh, Lycan through. Yes, we can cure you and you as well. Flumps. No, we can't do flumps. That's a DNA lab. Send patient home. At least they're not acting as uh, dead people, though. There's a QSI flu analysis. I know. I know. I wish there was something I could do about it. But there isn't, really. We need a... I'll tell you what. Let's... Because that nurse is just a temporary one. Let's see. Is there a... Yes. Diagnostics. Right. Millie Boo Monk. <laughs> you get in there. Right. And then on our staff, we'll actually get rid of uh, Lucy back. Because you're temp anyway, Lucy, I'm afraid. You were always going to be a temp. There we go. Yeah, and now because diagnosis, you're gonna give a, but you're gonna do a much better job at diagnosing people in there. Okay, so that's what we're happy about. Shock horror, no, can't even kill one person with shock horror at the minute. Drug mixers level two. Can we do a level two on that yet? No, we haven't really got many buildings to be able to upgrade yet until we build some of the uh, the other diagnosis stuff. But I don't know. I just feel like we're kind of stuck here. I feel like almost. To be honest with you, I'm tempted to completely restart this one and try again because I just I'm not sure we're uh, we're aiming we're aiming in the right direction. Electrical storms, nice. They were that was quite fun last time. <laughs> okay. February the first, we've dropped down to eight grand. Right, come on, let's 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 earn some money. Right, uh, this is um, impossible. <laughs> Every single month the money goes way down. We don't earn enough to build this room. I, I think this one needs a restart, to be honest with you. I think we've concentrated too much on training up specific staff, uh, as useful as that is. I think we've probably not grown enough. We, we need more ways of bringing in income. And at the moment, we've only really got GP, fluid analysis that takes forever, and then a couple of cures. And I, I think actually... Uh, we need to approach it a different way. So I will, off camera, try and get back up to a similar sort of point, but like, taking a slightly different tact, okay? And maybe not spend so much space on the buildings, because four buildings, we could get like six or seven buildings in here if we play it a bit better, okay? So um, I'm going to have another go in the next episode. Hopefully we'll pick up roughly where we left off. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, you can give us a like. It really does help out the channel. And if you're not already, don't forget to subscribe. Any thoughts, queries, or suggestions, you can pop them down in the comments. Fancy a chat that you can uh, find us on Twitter. I'm at John T. Sparrow. If you'd like to join in with the Geekism community, you can do so over on our Geekism Discord server. You'll find a link for that in the description. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.